What's up, you guys? My name is Mary and with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading, caps to side, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid, energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Um, thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. You guys are just the bestest. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. Very uh, private, confidential way to donate. Uh, do not publicly display your name or how much you donate, just to make that very abundantly clear. Um, thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. Um, we're at 12,075 subscribers right now. So, um, love you guys. I appreciate it so much. I do, I do, I do, do. Um, just want to, um, throw that out there. Okay. So I received a channel in this morning, so I'm going to share it. I hope everybody is doing fantastical. I do, I do, I do. Who? Uh, he is so lovey. You know, I just don't want his butt up in your face, butt up in my face. He misses some kiddos is what he does. Yeah. Okay. So the channel message I received was um, someone's business, um, heard a reader. I've been getting a lot of reader messages in lately. If y'all notice that, a lot of reader messages, but that's where we're at. So, you know, it is what it is. I have, um, I have a lot of business people on my ch uh, channel, which a lot of you guys are readers and you have businesses. Um, and congrats to that. A lot of readers, a lot of business people, a lot of entrepreneurs on here. I have a lot of people in the healthcare profession on here um, that I know of. I mean, of course, you know, the people that have told me. <laughs> um, and yeah, that's basically um, the gist of it. Um, so it's my, I think it's for one of you guys. There's a reason I'm pulling it in. Um, or somebody you're connected to, however that resonates. I'll just keep it up because he, he being so lovey. Um, but the channel message I received was... Um, a tarot card reader, a tarot card reader, I heard specifically with 10,000 subscribers and more. I heard that specifically. So they, I think they read on YouTube or another platform that has subscribers. Some platform that has subscribers. Um, I mean, YouTube obviously has subscribers, but there's other platforms that has subscribers. So whatever platform that is, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to, but somebody that has more 10,000 or 10,000 plus subscribers on the platform. So it is a established platform. Um, and it sounds, I mean, they've either been doing it a while or at least for a little bit to gain 10,000 subscribers. I'm just saying. Um, but I heard basically um, their business is about to surge up in a very, very, very positive way. Very well deserved. That's what I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So it's somebody out in the universe, a reader, I heard. Um, so, you know, whatever you deem yourself, whether it's a spiritual practitioner, I think your light side, hopefully, um, spiritual practitioner, um, psychic medium, psychic investigator, whatever you deem yourself, you work in the spiritual community in some shape, form, or fashion. You could have the players or not have the players, I'm not sure, um, but I heard your business is about to surge up in a very, very, very positive way. You have at least 10,000 subscribers in the universe, whoever you are, and however that applies. By the way, this is Daily Key um, today, um, just saying. So yeah, you plug it in how it resonates. It's pretty awesome, whoever this is for. Let me see if I hear anything else. Also, also, someone in this connected in this situation is about to be contacted and be asked to write a statement regarding money laundering. This person is not was not connected to the money laundering. It can be proven. Oh, whoa. Well, this is. This one. 
this went off left pretty quickly, but I mean, it is what it is. So, uh, okay. So who, okay. It's either you or somebody you're connected to, uh, lot, I'm hopefully light side spiritualist that has 10,000 or 10,000 plus subscribers, whoever you are and how this resonates. I feel you're either about to be contacted to be asked to write a statement regarding some money laundering or somebody you're connected to is about to be asked to write a statement regarding some kind of money laundering. However, that resonates. But whoever's about to be asked to write the statement um, regarding this money laundering, I heard they're not connected. They were not connected to the money laundering. Um, I heard it can be proven. So I don't know if the person about to contact you uh, asking you, person or people about to contact you, asking you to write the statement on the money laundering. I don't know if um, they already have the evidence and proof that you were not connected to the money laundering or they want you to provide the evidence and proof you were not connected. I'm presuming they probably already have it. But you plug it in how it resonates. Uh, it sounds like they've been doing some investigation of their own and they realize you were not connected. But it's important for your statement. Uh, I feel for some, you were... You were probably the scapegoat energy. They like some, and I didn't hear any of this. This is just my deductive logic reasoning on this. I feel for whoever this is for, and however this resonates for whoever, because it's at least for one of you guys in the universe. I feel maybe you were a scapegoat energy on, in this situation. I feel for some, they wanted you to be. They were trying to set you up to like you were the money launderer, but people are realizing that you were not in this money. You were not a money launderer. You were not connected into this and that it was a setup. But your statement is very, very, very important um, in this. Because I feel for some, you were one one of the ones they were trying to set up. Is exactly what I'm feeling. Um, so I feel um, for whoever this is for, probably they already know you were not connected to the money laundering or they're about to learn it. Um, but I heard it can be proven that you were not connected to the money laundering anyway. So whether you actually provide the proof that you were not connected, um, or they already have the proof, how that resonates, but at least whether you're the reader, reader with 10,000 plus subscribers, business owner, entrepreneur, light side, hopefully light side spiritualist that your business is about to tank up, whether you're the one that somebody tried to set up. Like you were a money launderer or connected into some kind of money laundering scheme or scam or what have you, or it's somebody connected to you about to be contacted um, to write this statement. How that resonates, I feel it can go both ways. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Wow, unexpected income upright. Number 27 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 27. It can be a possible age of viewers, somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible day of birth number, possible green card number, possible jersey number. Um, number 27, unexpected income upright. Energies are about to shift in a huge way. Somebody was being a very manipulative, dirty magician in the past, using someone's tarot card readings to make the wheel go in their favor. However, it has backfired in their face in a huge way. Tower moments coming for, the, for these people. Through many shocking series of chain of events, balance is about to be restored and a... Um, Someone's about to get a shocking phone call for a settlement. And someone's about to get a shocking phone call for a large payout in a company they should have had a long time ago. Wow! We've had a lot of, uh, a lot of payout energies from companies in the um, energetic space recently. A lot of them. Um, a, a lot of you guys, I feel, was in my situation the whole wrongful termination and um, the whole wrongful termination, but somebody, you were deserved to pay out, but somebody knew you were deserved to pay out. For some, I feel it was your family members because that's what I got in a reading previously. For some, it was a doppelganger of yours, but they knew you deserved to pay out and you were supposed to have the payout. For some, you knew you were deserved to pay out, but you never got the communication or the paperwork 
to go forth with the payout because, I mean, you were wrongfully terminated, embarrassed, and mortified, and disrespected, and yet those people were waiting in the wings just to take your money, basically, which is sad. Um, but it sounds like balance is about to come. Um, whoever this is for, somebody has been watching somebody's tarot readings very strategically. It sounds like past energy. They have been watching their tarot readings very strategically uh, for, for, like, karmic energy. To hurt, harm, destroy, and steal, basically. Um, it was not to use it and apply it in their life in a very positive fashion. It was basically to hurt, harm, st or steal. Period. Um, but I heard it's a, it has already started backfiring on this, some of these people. And for some, it's about to. I heard huge negative tower moments coming for them. So, I mean, like, I heard tower moment. Now, a tower moment can be a life-altering event, either positively or negatively. In this situation, it is a negative tower moment for them. Um, but, the, oh, it's the first card on here. But they shouldn't have strategically, it sounds like they were strategically watching either your channel or somebody you're connected to's channel. Um, I feel it's a public platform. I don't feel it's just somebody that just gave them a tarot reading. I feel it's a public platform associated for fashion. It's kind of like this. They were strategically watching this, I'm feeling, public platform to create negative towers, either for the reader they were um, watching or somebody else. Um, and it sounds like it was effective in the past, but it, I heard the energy is about to completely shift. And now they're about to get major negative towers in their own life. Negative towers, because like I said, this can be positive or it can be negative. In this sense, it is negative towers, but in all fairness, they have used someone's spiritual gifts um, in a negative sense, either their spiritual gifts or their gifts of reading, period, in a negative sense for their own life, their own selfish gain. Some of them, they're involved in money laundering, for God's sakes. I mean, so it's pretty, that's pretty sad. So now it sounds like energetically in the universal space, it's about to boomerang back on them and create negative towers for them because they were putting such negative out in the universe in the past. Some of them regarding, I think they might get charged with money laundering soon. And I'm serious about that. So, I mean, I'm serious because at least one of you guys, whether you're the reader or not, or somebody connected to the reader, is about to get contacted to write a statement regarding some kind of money laundering they were not ever involved with to begin with. So now, one of the negative tower moments is about to be, them about to be connected to money laundering. Um, whether they were an accessory or they knew information and they didn't share it with police or feds or etc etc or what have you um somebody's about to be connected to this money laundering uh to, and other negative things um some 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 is the money laundering some it is stealing your payout or payouts from a company where you were wrongfully terminated i'm feeling um and using that money for themselves when they should have even had it to begin with but somebody has already realized this or they're about to and that could be negative tower moments as well so you plug it in, how it resonates. And on the flip side, though, you're about to get a phone call or phone calls. Some uh, unexpected settlement, I heard. Uh, offer of an uh, unexpected settlement. So that, you know, whoever is calling, I mean, however that applies in one's life, um, it could be, there could be a settlement. It could be a settlement on any aspect in playing. Um, however that applies but it's an unexpected phone call you're not expecting this phone call to call to settle this unexpectedly for the settlement whoever you are um and some it is unexpected phone call from as i feel the company same company or companies that wrongfully terminated you regarding this very large payout you were supposed to have all along but you never got it so to me the unexpected income here is um the unexpected phone call for the offer of the settlement for some, and for some, the unexpected phone call from the a company you used to work at that wrongfully terminate or companies that you used to work at that wrongfully terminated you. And it sounds like the settlement, I mean, the payout went through somebody else for some kind of fraud energy or possible money laundering energy. But people have already figured it out or they're about to. And it's going to be your unexpected income where it should have been on law which is going to create negative tower moments for the thieves or thieves, the fraud or frauds. You plug it in, how it resonates. That's really beautiful. You guys, let me see if I hear anything else.
You're about to have mega manifestation. Mega manifestation. Very, 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 very well deserved. Very. It is about to make a lot of people jealous and pissed, but you do not worry about those other people. Oh, my Lord. So you plug it in how it resonates. I heard you're about to have mega manifestation. Mega. Um, so manifestation is basically growing, 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 growing. It can be manifestation of money, love, positive connections. Um, you're growing and developing yourself or your children. It's growing and developing something in a positive way. Manifestation is. So whatever that mega manifestation is and how it applies in your life. I heard you're about to have mega manifestation. I'm feeling this, the reader with 10,000 plus subscribers, the person that was stole from and wrongfully terminated from a company, um, the person that was, I'm thinking, was trying to be set up for some kind of money laundering scheme, but person or people have figured out that they're not connected. Um, however, that applies. Um, and um, you're about to have mega manifestation. It sounds like you're about to get, some of you guys are about to get money you should have had all along. All along, um, I heard other people are about to get very, they're about to be very jealous and very pissed that this is about to happen for you, basically. But I heard basically do not, do not pay those people any mention, uh, any mind. Basically, stay in your lane, stay in your bubble, and you keep charging forward in whatever creative projects or endeavors Whoever is about to get this money, I think you're about to use it in a very positive sense. I don't think you're going to go out there and run it street side, create these crazy illegal businesses. I don't. I think you're going to use it in a positive sense. I think you're going to create it, create positive businesses, positive things in your community. I think um, if you have children or ch child or children, you're going to use it on them, use it on yourself, use it on your home. Positive things is what I'm saying. I don't think you're going to go out there and run it all over the streets. And whoever is about to do this for you um, and may, help make this right, I think they know this. Um, however, that plugs in. One of these, one of these people about to be contacted, they are going to lowball you with the settlement. You will have to, um, you will have to, re, we have to renegotiate. But it will be very worth it. Okay, I heard one of these people. Okay, so it's at least two plus you guys in the universe is about to be called about a negotiation for settlement, uh, whoever you are, um, and how this applies. You have to plug yourself in where you fit. There's a lot of moving pieces and a lot of things going on in here, so you really have to plug yourself in wherever you fit if you do. If you don't, you don't. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. But somebody is about to get called back regarding a settlement, at least two of you guys in the universe. I heard at least for one of you guys, um, and you're not going to expect a phone call. So this is unexpected income, but it's more like unexpected communication. I'm um, just saying, just saying for the phone call energy. Um, but I heard you're, you're not going to expect it. But one of these situations, I heard they're going to try to lowball you. Lowball you pretty bad with the settlement um, offer. Um, it is worth a lot, 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 a lot. They know this. It is. Renegotiation for sure. Get what you deserve. Okay, I heard it's worth basically a ton. Whatever you have on these people. I don't know if it's video evidence, if it's um, proof, like bank statement proof, video um, evidence, um, some other kind of evidence or proof. You have something huge. And whoever is about to call and offer you this offer, whether it's a company, a city, a federal agency, um, the government, whoever, somebody knows you have something huge. You have something freaking huge, whatever it is. Um, and they're going to try to lowball you, I heard. They're, so anybody doesn't know lowball means basically not off, off you, not what it's worth. They're going to try to get away with offering you basically pennies um, for what you truly have whatever evidence or documents or whatever it is you have to substantiate your claim or claims, um, they're going to try to offer you basically pennies on the dollar what it's worth. So, but they know they're about to do this. I heard it'd be very smart to renegotiate it because it's worth so, so, so much more than what they're about to offer you. They know this. 
But hopefully you know this too. And you create a tower moment for them in a negative sense and renegotiate that because I heard you deserve so much more. So hopefully somebody can uh, view this video if this resonates for you and get this. Um, hopefully if this resonates with you and you realize, get this reading before the phone call happens, hopefully, and you can think on this video and um, hopefully it helps you. So you plug it in how it resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. Okay, I didn't. I didn't. But I was wondering, I'm done with the reading. Y'all can click off. But I was going to say real quick before I close this reading officially, I was wondering why I got unexpected income upright for the um, settlement and the um, payout energy. And I mean, you would have thought it would have come up as sudden wealth is what I'm saying. I would have thought it would have come up as sudden wealth. But it makes complete sense now because they're going to lowball your ass. They are going to lowball your ass. Uh, the payout energy for the companies, I don't think they can. I think it's a standard amount of money. I mean, I've never had a payout from a company ever, ever in my life. And I was, I've been wrongfully terminated three times uh, in the universe. And I've never had a payout from a company ever. So I don't know the amounts of payouts. Um, and I'm a registered nurse. I'm a registered nurse. And I, I have been since licensed to, since 2013. And 38-year-old woman and never had a payout, even though I've been wrongfully terminated three times in the universe. But what I'm saying is I think the payouts from the companies are standard amounts of money. So they, I don't think they can lowball you because it's standard amounts of money is what I'm presuming here. Um, I think this is the lowball energy for the settlement energy. I think this is, I was wondering why it came out unexpected income and not sudden wealth because they're going to lowball your ass. They want you to accept less than what you're worth or less than what they know they should be offering your ass. So that, that makes sense now. But I think hopefully you create a tower on their ass. So you plug it in how it resonates. It's kind of like, um, it's kind of like um, negotiating, like going to a car lot and negotiating. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but I've never, um, I've bought several, uh, I've bought new vehicles and I've bought new to me vehicles. So used vehicles and new, new vehicles. I have never paid the sticker price at a car lot ever. My dad taught me that many, many years ago. Never do that. Never do that shit. Stay there for hours if you have to and negotiate to your hands are blue in the face. Um, but never pay the sticker price, period, point blank, at a car lot. And some uh, uh, car salesmen are usually the sneakiest and most deceptive salespeople out there, period. I trust me, I know that from experience. And I'm not saying these people, this is a car salesman type situation. I'm just comparing it to the lowball offer, basically, um, for the settlement. So you plug it in how it resonates. All right, you guys, I love you guys so much. Everybody made wonderful, wonderful choices and namaste. Oh, hold on, I got one more. Someone is about to give someone information to your channel soon. They are about to view your videos. It is about to backfire on the person that gave them the information to your channel in a huge way. They want to create a negative tower for you, but it's about to boomerang back on them. This person is actually going to love your channel. Oh my God. So you plug it in how it resonates. Wow, man. Well, you know, that's the, their negative karma. And I mean, that's just the truth. So somebody is about to basically spread your channel, but it, I don't think they're going to spread it word of mouth, like very publicly or like social media very publicly. I, it sounds like they're going to run their gab or like gossip, gossip Gale or gossip dairy energy to a specific person or people for strategic reasons. I heard they want to create negative tower for you. So they want to create a negative tower for you. So it's not like they're like, Blasting it on their social media in a positive way. Like, hey, I love this reader. I love this channel. You should check it out. Blasey, 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 blasey. Um, they are strategically like planting seeds in this person or people so they will check your channel out. But I don't think they're talking you up in a positive light. I think they want you check. They want this person or people to check your channel out so they will... Um, 
so it'll backfire on you. But I heard basically the person's going to love your channel. They're going to love your channel and it's about to backfire on them. So it's actually, they want to create a negative tower for you. But in Heinz, um, in reality, it sounds like it's about to energetically boomerang back on their ass. And it's going to create a negative tower on them. But they shouldn't have strategically planted seeds in a, for a sneaky, stra uh, strategic, deceptive, manipulative way just to get somebody to view your channel to create you a negative tower. They should have done it out of love and giving and altruism to the universe. Whoever this is, they're very greedy and they're strategic and they're malicious and they wanted to create, I heard they wanted to create you a negative tower. But this person's going to love your work, basically, and it's going to create you a positive tower. So, well, that person that um, is either uh, already planted seeds to this person or people or is about to, that's that's um that's their karma and i'm serious about that so you plug it in how it resonates there are a lot of reader energy in here a lot of reader energy a lot of people viewing readers channels for strategic reasons in here a lot all right well i love you guys so much everybody made wonderful choices and namaste